Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have the new Stella and Dot Summer 2016 line to share with you guys today. Not everything, of course, but the samples that I picked up personally. Um, I am getting over kind of a nasty cold, so if I sound a little manly or if I have to edit because I just to have a massive coughing spree. I apologize. I don't know. It's a rough one. Anyway, okay, so most of you guys probably know I am a stylist with Stella and Dot. I have been for the past two years and I have loved it. I have a whole playlist of previous videos. I did just want to give you guys a quick update on my own jewelry line and if you don't care about that, I will just put the time below where the Stella and Dot. But if you've been following me for a while, a few of you guys probably know that a Around this time last year, I actually started my own jewelry line. It was called Gemma Michelle Collection after my daughter, and it was all delicate pieces, and I had a lot of fun with it. Right now, just about everything has sold out, and I wanted to kind of take it a little bit further. I wanted to do more statement pieces. I wanted to get involved with companies who could help me cast and mold and, you know, really design from the start to finish and I've had a lot of issues just finding the right company within my price range and within even my own country so um, at this point I've decided not to restock um, so yeah I've decided not to restock at this point it was a lot of fun and I may pick it up again in the future but for now, um, I'm not going to be restocking it. I have to also just kind of pick and choose what I do in my spare time. Obviously, I still do Stella and Dot. I love YouTube, and I'm a mom of two, so, you know, there's only so many hours in a day. But anyway, I just wanted to give you guys an update on that because I know a few of you had asked. But without further ado, let's get on to the Stella and Dot haul. Okay, so like I said, I am a stylist. I will leave my email below. I am in Canada, so if you are in Canada and you would like... A lookbook sent to you this is the new summer one I also have the um, larger ones from spring 2016 you can shoot me off an email and I can stick one in the mailbox for you I gotta say this line is one of my absolute favorite launches because they have expanded from just jewelry to just like a kind of a broad variety of just fashion and accessories in general of course they still have jewelry but they've also um, expanded into sunglasses watches tunics that are sized so they're doing like sort of like a, their own little clothing line I'm really excited and you can really put together your your whole like summer wardrobe based around this line so I'm really excited so I'm gonna get started with the earrings that I have on right now and of course I will do a close-up so you guys can see these are called the Mirage chandeliers and let me just pop one out I just love how these move like they just have just this great amount of movement they are hinged and then they've got the little tassels with the little beads these have so much detail if you look closely you'll see that they actually have hand embroidered sequins all along the top arc there and they're just stunning I love the little beads I love that the gold is more of an antique kind of finish so it's not super super shiny I just I love these I think they look awesome with just a plain black top like I have on today but I was also love to wear these just with like a nice florally dress in the summer or you know just like a nice blouse and some ripped jeans these are definitely one of my favorite pieces from the line and if you're someone who's more into statement necklaces or pendants as opposed to earrings there is a necklace that matches these it's basically the same sort of idea I think it has three arcs um, and then it hangs on a longer chain so it's just like a larger pendant version of this it's got the tassels it's absolutely beautiful so that is available as well the other pair of earrings that I picked up from the line are called the bungalow hoops here they are love 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 these I'm a huge fan of hoop earrings in general again you've got that kind of antique gold finish and you've got this beautiful fringe detail and I should say anything with a fringe or a tassel is completely on trend for summer 2016 you'll see it in all of the like in style Vogue magazines and this line definitely features a lot of that um, trend so I love that these I have been wearing quite a bit lately um, I posted a picture on Instagram I was trying to get a good shot of me wearing them and my kids kept photo bombing me I'll show you guys that picture because it's kind of funny but these are super lightweight again they just have like a little bit of movement so there's just a little something extra they're a great size and super comfortable so really really love these 
Okay, so next up I want to show you guys one of the necklaces that I picked up. This is going to be my go-to layering piece for the summer. Definitely show you guys a close-up of this because the detail is phenomenal. This is called the Tiburon Necklace and just like most pieces from Stella and Dodd, it's got built-in um, versatility. So up here you will see all of the chains are hooked together, but you can unclip them and then you can wear any combination of these three pieces separately or together. My favorite piece is definitely this one with the, the little silver horn. I love it. I love that it's done in a matte silver. Really pretty. Um, this piece has some beautiful detail. I'll insert a close-up again. But you've got glass and semi-precious stone beads. So really, really pretty. And in person, this just like... I don't know, it's got the most beautiful kind of reflective qualities. It's really, really beautiful. And then you've got this silver piece, which is just kind of like a basic antiqued chain, but just adds a really, really nice touch to this piece. So I love this. Like I said, you can wear them all together or any combination of them alone. Of course, layering pieces, necklaces, and bracelets is just a huge trend and just looks amazing. I think if you're wearing like a basic shirt but then you throw on some layered necklaces, it just takes your outfit from like here to here. It's just so, so pretty. I love that um, sort of a look. And so if you're someone who wants to do that, participate in that trend, but you're not really sure where to start, Picking up a piece like this is a great uh, a great way to do that because the work is kind of done for you and then as you build upon your collection you can mix and match other pieces and it's just, it works. So I absolutely love this piece. If you guys have been with me for a while you may know I am a huge sucker for wrap bracelets and Stella and Dot released a few and this is definitely my favorite from the collection. It is just this really, really long um, bracelet and what you do is you just obviously wrap it around your wrist but if you look closely there are all kinds of different elements within this bracelet so the first strand is just um, like some beads and then some gold and silver chain the next section you've got some like more gold beads you've got this woven piece which is really beautiful and a lot of these pieces were inspired from Oaxaca Mexico and you can definitely see like the spirit of Oaxaca in this particular section and then you've got this kind of like macrame section here. So they're all attached but you just wrap them around your wrist and it looks like you've collected friendship bracelets and layered them in just a really perfect way. So this is definitely one of my favorite pieces and the other cool thing is that there are one, two, three, four different loops on the end here so you can um, size it however you like so um, you know it will fit a variety of, of wrist sizes but I just think I think this is just so beautiful and perfect for summer. So the next piece I have is called the Raina Necklace and I should show you guys, I didn't really take a minute to show you guys the packaging. I think this packaging has been available for a while now but packaging from Stella and Dot is always cute. Um, there's lots of details. This just says what you love and it's got little hearts and love the gold foil print so packaging is always super cute. So this is called the Reina Necklace and I have it in the multicolor. Um, it also comes in a neutral color which is done in brown and like wooden beads and whites and it's just it's a beautiful neutral piece. I was really loving the whole Oaxaca inspired theme so I went for the more colorful one. The detail in this is just stunning. You've got little tiny beads, you've got the dangly pieces which are definitely my favorite. Um, and the cool thing about this is you can wear it as a necklace just as a longer layering piece. You can wrap it around your neck twice and get more of this kind of a look or you can wear it as a wrap bracelet and that's definitely my favorite way to wear it. Um, you know, just keep wrapping it around your wrist and I love how the little charms just hang and you've got this kind of like, you know, charm bracelet effect and again, you can customize the length because you've got quite a bit of chain here to work with and you can, you know, hook it wherever you like so it will fit a variety of wrist sizes. So absolutely love this and this would look pretty just you know layered by itself or with other bracelets for a really really beautiful arm party. Okay so the last bracelet that I have is probably my favorite and it's it's all due to what it stands for. So this is the Pave Wishing Bracelet in Gold and if you're familiar with Stella and Dot um, they support a lot of different causes and foundations and April is Autism Awareness Month so every year in April they team up with the Holly Rod Foundation and they create a piece that um, 
All of the net proceeds from go to um, the Holly Rod Foundation, which supports um, autism awareness. So this here is, is really beautiful. And this wasn't actually the original one that they did. If you follow me on Instagram, I was keeping you guys updated on that. Um, it was very similar to this one. It's a pull, pull string double chain bracelet and the original one that they did this year had a bar of pave crystals but they were done in a gradient of colors um, like blues and greens it was absolutely stunning it sold out in the first four days so that's amazing because all of those net proceeds benefited the holly rod foundation but that one is no longer available and i kicked myself for not getting it right away i waited till i could order my other samples i shouldn't have done that but at any rate um they did release three other wishing bracelets and all of the net proceeds are still going towards the Holly Rod Foundation. So if you order this one, um, the money will still support a really good cause. I love, love, love this piece. It looks great alone or layered. Um, I have a photo or a little video clip of me wearing it with the Raina Multi and I think that's a really nice combination. But this just looks beautiful and I love the packaging that it comes in really great gift to give someone who is touched by autism who has a family member or a friend or you know I'm I'm a teacher I'm not teaching currently I'm a stay-at-home mom right now but I taught a lot of kids with autism I have a lot of teacher friends who teach kids with autism and you know these just make great gifts um because they're for a great cause so I just I love this one and they really they really knocked it out of the park this year with this bracelet I think okay so that is it for the jewelry let me show you guys these sunglasses that I picked. so here's a quick picture of all five of the styles they have aviators they have oversized um, they have like some more Wayfair styles really cool selection now I have a really really awful time finding sunglasses because I have a longer and narrower face everything looks oversized on me anyway so I went for the oversized sunglasses because I figure if they're going to be oversized they might as well be really oversized. Um, all of the sunglasses come in this really beautiful case. This is the breeze block pattern which again is another Mexico inspired pattern. So these are your oversized um, sunglasses. Got really nice detail on the side there. Wraps around to a little arrow in the front. These are extremely high quality. Um, you can feel in the hinges they are not cheap sunglasses. They're made, they're handmade, and they're handmade using the same techniques as brands like Gucci and Armani. Um, they're hand polished, they have UVA, UVB protection, so they're really great quality sunglasses, and I love them. I think they are just super cute. Um, again, they're gonna look super oversized on me because I have such a narrow face. I'm really excited that they're doing sunglasses. I think this is an excellent addition to the line. So the other exciting thing that they recently started doing are tunics, and these are all sized. So that's really cool. Um, I actually have the size extra small, small, and these are a very generous fit. So there are, whoops, this just fell off the hair. There are three different styles available. I chose this one. I love the custom embroidery pattern, and you can also wear this, you know, um, Obviously you can wear it as a beach cover up over a bathing suit which would be super pretty but I think this also makes a really pretty sort of blouse um, if you wanted to wear it with white skinny jeans or just you know plain denim jeans or even like some cut off shorts. Super super pretty. I'm going to insert a picture of me wearing this and I apologize because my three year old had to take it so pretty sure my head's cut off but hey. She was the only assistant I had available <laughs> when I was taking these pictures, but um, I love this shirt. I love it. And the, the quality is just, you can tell this isn't like a cheaply made shirt. It just feels, feels kind of luxurious. So I'm really excited about this. There are two other styles. Um, and like I said, they are a bit oversized. Generally, I would get like a small to medium, but the extra small to small was a good fit for me. So I would size down in these. So the other thing that they started doing is sized sarongs, which is pretty cool because, you know, sometimes depending on what size you are, like a sarong can have too much fabric or not enough fabric. And so these have just the perfect amount of fabric. Again, I got the extra small, small, and here it is. And you can obviously tighten it um, on the side if you want to make it a little bit bigger or smaller. But this is just like a shorter sarong and it's got beautiful fringe detail again which is totally on um, trend the little tassels now the cool thing and kind of the main reason that I picked this up is because 
it's a multifunctional piece and you can actually just roll it up like this and then you have an infinity scarf and I love the look of this with the little tassels as an infinity scarf. I have a black moto jacket and I thought this would just be the perfect touch to that so again it's just like multifunctional, super versatile and I love it. Okay, the last thing that I picked up from this line is this super, super adorable little crossbody bag. Again, you've got that Mexican inspired vibe happening here. I love the print, I love the tassel. My favorite part though might be the inside. You get this kind of unexpected pop of hot pink. Love this pattern. And then you open it up and you've just got enough space in here for like your cell phone, a little bit of makeup. There's a little zip compartment if you want to put some change in there. And then if you don't want to carry a wallet, I know my wallet is too large to fit in here, but there are some little credit card or debit card um, holders here so you don't have to take your wallet. You can just kind of stick what you need. And I think this is just an awesome piece. There's also a little pocket in the back if you wanted to put something there. I love this. This is gonna be my go-to just little like bag when I'm just, you know, out walking, like maybe on the boardwalk or, you know, we're just visiting some place for the day. I don't want to take a huge bag, but I just want like, you know, a little bit of money and, um, like my phone and I think this is just perfect and it's super super cute they also did a larger tote version of this which I was really tempted to get but I had to kind of control myself so and that is that. Okay guys, so that is what I picked up from the Stella and Dots Summer 2016 line. I'm absolutely in love with this line as you can probably tell. Um, I will have my link below. Just be aware I am a stylist. You are supporting me, which I totally su appreciate if you choose to do. Um, but I am in Canada, so if you are in Canada, you can definitely shop my link. If you're not, I will put a couple of my US um, Stella and Dot YouTube friends below and feel free to shop their links um, because they're they're awesome as well. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll also, like I said, leave my email in case you want me to stick a lookbook in the mail for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you haven't subscribed, please go ahead and do so. Take care of each other, and I'll see you soon. Bye, guys.